joining us today on Black Investments Matter. I'm Antoine Anderson, and today we're going to be looking at three crowdfunding applications used to invest in retail or rental properties throughout America. Um, these are passive income generators, so they say, and this is just the brief overall or exposure to what they are and what they're all about. The application we're going to talk about in this class of investing to generate um, passive income is Streetwise. Streetwise and all of the other uh, maps we're talking about today are in the class of uh, real estate investment trust, meaning that these are companies that are formed to split up ownership of a particular piece of property or a rental unit and sell those back as shares to any of the potential investors. For instance, if I wanted to buy 10 shares in one apartment rental um, and somebody else was would do the same we all become shareholders of a property it's much like if you were becoming shareholder of a company obviously there's a limited amount of shares based on the price of a home or the homes that you are going to be getting dividends on um, the dividend structure for these uh, type of investments have been ranging from I think the high end was what I'm seeing here with Streetwise at 8.9% down to probably about 4.3% of our annual return. Um, when you think about that in terms of investing, what if you were to go out and you know find a home for $250,000? I don't think you're going to find any in the $100,000 range anymore, not in this state of game and the in state of play in the United States. But let's just say you had $250,000 and you're written a, 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 that home out um, and getting paid whatever you're getting paid in the land or something like that, it'd probably go around two and a half, three thousand dollars a month um, in rent. And that's one way to look at it, but you will have to maintain that property as a landlord. You're gonna have to deal with the tenants issues as a landlord. You're gonna have to comply with um, the state and local government um, edicts for that property. Um, God forbid you get into an eviction status. You know, these real estate investment trusts are a way to avoid all that. Now you're offsetting that with um, the fees that you're going to be paying for these ownerships, these these provisional ownerships of these these shares. And, um, is it profitable enough for you to get involved in it? That's the big question. And uh, first up, obviously, with Streetwise, offering an 8.9% annualized return, something that you might want to look into and as a way to get started. Next on the list is a company um, called Elevate.Money. Um, they're offering a 6.5% annual return on your investment. Same class, these are rent. Um, uh, real estate investment trust. Um, you can download many of these apps to your phone. We're going to provide the links to each one of these applications at the bottom of the video, and you can go ahead and do your own research on them. Um, I myself look at these as a way to earn a little bit of money on a little bit of an investment. Um, if I want to do a quick invest of a hundred bucks on something and just earn what what coffee money per per month on that hundred dollars, yeah, that might be something I might be looking into. Other than trying to jump way into the game with a huge amount of money and potentially getting enough of a return that I can sit back and retire on, because then it doesn't become passive income; it becomes primary income. Um, these apps are not to be, um, you know, just jumped into lightly. If you want to earn some money in real estate, this might be a way for a beginner to get started, but I would definitely check with a financial advisor before investing large sums of money in any of these things. Black Investments Matter is a tool or resource to, to provide information to those who do not have access to those resources and this is a way to also let you know what's out there versus telling you what to invest in and what not to invest in that's not what we do here we are not pros at this by any means of the imagination 
We are here to provide a service and to provide a resource to give you the information you need to produce um, passive income. Now let's talk about Fundrise. Fundrise was probably the OG in the game and they give you details on how it works, um, building your portfolio based on uh, resilient assets. Resilient assets are classed, we're talking about assets in the $5.1 billion collectively that they own. And they're specifically talking about real estate. Um, They have information on client returns and whatnot and what that actually means over a length of time after you know a certain amount of years they're saying after year one you can get about 7.1 percent of a return on your investment or or at least um an annualized uh a rate of return after a year i have my doubts i've you know i haven't gotten into this class of investing yet myself but as a way of bringing this information to uh, to our viewers you got to know what's out there to see if it's going to work for you or not um, fundrise was offering um a good mix of investments uh return strategies i think it was in the neighborhood of 6.1 percent on some of the average um, returns that uh, the investors were genuinely expected to receive. As such, um, they do have uh, the appropriate number of fees associated with this. And again, none of these things are without some downside. I mean, while you're not going to be responsible for the day-to-day monthly um, maintenance of a property, the company does that. And you're basically receiving a check for your investment. Um, it it is attractive to some some investors. Um, another one that you should just definitely look into. Uh, after we're going to be reviewing the day, I know initially we talked about three. This is the fourth one. This is called Lambda. Now Lambda app um, had a bumpy start. It uh, launched in 2019 and then relaunched in 2021. But out of the four, um, this one has the lowest entry point. You can buy or invest in real estate for as little as five bucks, as it says on the webpage. But the one thing or one drawback that this has over the other platforms is that it by far has the highest amount of fees that are collected um, out of the this class of investment vehicles. Um, known as real estate investment trust companies. Now, as always, these applications don't require the investor to check on the properties themselves. Um, You're collecting a dividend check either monthly and getting an annual um, dividend return in the 4 to 9% range. Um, It's a way to get started. It's a way to get your feet wet and something that you might want to Um, include in your portfolio as a way to generate passive income. Now, this information and all their information will continue to be coming out as we start to navigate different tools other than cryptocurrency. We'll still be doing our cryptocurrency here at Black Investments Matters, but um, right now is a good time to see what else is out there. If you like this content, or even if you do, or even if you don't, please hit the like and subscribe button and uh, click that uh, Black Investments Matter logo in the corner. And I will see you next time.